So how did the track list for the album come about? Did you write the opening to the opener, close a bit closer, shuffle around and see what fits? What was that process like? Um, you know, I, I didn't write any song to be a specific moment. I didn't write the opener to be the opener or the closer to be the closer. But it's funny you bring that up because once I, both of those, once I started them, I was like, oh, like, this is the opener or this is the closer. Like both of those just like, I was like, this is it for sure. Um, and then I don't know, everything else I just kind of like, I always make a SoundCloud playlist um, when I'm trying to figure out a track listing and just like really like live with a few different versions of it. But honestly, this one came pretty easily. Like it made sense to me pretty quickly. You know, you mentioned, you know, during the last answer that um, you, you weren't writing for an album initially. So at what point in the process did you kind of realize you were writing for a record? Um, you know, I think it was like definitely a couple months in because I, I love writing and I try to and I just love collaborating like, I think it helps me evolve as an artist. I think it's like fun to like meet new people to work with and like, just continue to like, get to know more people in my community. And um, so I had been still consistently like doing sessions and stuff with people and um, I I guess it was a couple months into that when I had like a handful of songs and it was kind of around the time when I started making a little bit more of um, a concerted effort to like be less vague in my songs and to like say like write about a few things where I was like okay this kind of is like starting to make sense to me and um, so I don't know it was probably like around it was probably around like the new year last year in 2023 when i was like cool i have all these songs this is a record gotcha makes sense